Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, yeah, I'm still on my webcam. I'm gonna put on my glasses because I would like to share what I own as far as pigments, minerals, loose powders. I think I'm gonna start off with um LA colors. It comes like this. Usually you could get these for a dollar at your Dollar Tree. This is in honeysuckle and on the eyes. It is truly, <laughs> I'm sorry about that. It is truly, truly beautiful. It's a gorgeous color. That's true to color right there. So these cost a dollar at local beauty supply stores or at your Dollar Tree. That's Honeysuckle. This one's one of my favorites. And this is in Grape Jelly. The pigment, um, a mineral you can make a colored nail polish if you have um, a clear nail polish you don't care about. The one that you buy at the Dollar Tree and it costs you only a dollar. You can make a colored nail polish. This one in Lollipop, you can make a pretty pink nail polish. Uh, clear gloss that it's cheap, you don't care about. Yeah, it only costs a dollar too. You can make a lip gloss. It'll match. So again, those lollipop. This is sunshine. It's a beautiful gold color. Now these come like this. Paper up, and that's the brush. Yeah. I've depotted most of mine. These are just some that I didn't get a chance to depot. So. Oh no, here goes another one. I'm sorry. And this one is in Radiant. Oh, this is gorgeous. It's Radiant. It's beautiful. Dollar Trees, Dollar Generals, Dollar Stores, Deals. Full of these. I know the beauty supply stores are. Here in New York, I know that for a fact. Um, I also own a lot of Profusion. Now, the reason why these don't... <laughs> That's what happens when I don't use webcam for a while. These are by Profusion, and um, when Profusion first came out, the pigments, they didn't have any names. So this one is a, an off-white. That's a charcoal a baby, but what, you know, you guys can see that. They're beautiful. On the lids, this nail polish. Sky's the limit. Okay, I'm going to come to this one. The first four, <laughs> these stickers curled up. I've had these for a long time. First four, oh, uh, next. The last three, four, excuse me. Um, Profusion. This top one by NYX is in Penny Pearl. This is the top one right there. That's Penny Pearl on top. And the second one is Orange Pearl. That third one is mocha pearl that's mocha pearl right there it's gorgeous and the last one is rust pearl it's rust pearl right there oh excuse me the last one is by nix also i said yeah black pearl oh okay yeah that's black pearl by nix oh beautiful another stack this is all nix i believe yes the top one is Lilac Pearl, the very top. You see that stuff that was taped? Because when we moved, I had to tape up all my stacks. Maybe that's um, Lilac Pearl. The second is Baby Pink Pearl, which is this one. That's Baby Pink Pearl. And there is Ocean Blue Pearl right here. They're gorgeous. And um, yes, I have a lot of mixed pigments and Profusion. Profusion has always been a dollar. LA's Colors always been a dollar. They're, those shadows are pigments. Um, the NYX ones, they used to be a dollar as well. Mm -hmm. Anyways, um, under Baby Blue Pearl is Nude Pearl. And that's nude pearl right here. That is nude pearl. 
Under that is walnut pearl. Take markings. I started the walnut pearl right there. They're gorgeous. Mink pearl, which is what I am wearing on my hoods right now because I recorded a tutorial using that. It's mink pearl. Under that is oro pearl. And oro stands for gold in Spanish. It's oro pearl. And this one is yellow gold pearl. And that's all the way at the bottom. I have my room over here. Oh. Okay, let's see this one. Profusion. This is all profusion. You see it doubles because the bottles used to be big and yeah. When they first came out with their pigments, they were very generous. This one is all profusion, with the exception of this one right here, which is Jessie's Girl, and it's in Catalyst. Down real low. That was one of my favorites, Catalyst. As well as this blue right here at the bottom. Gorgeous. They're all so beautiful. I might have to do this in parts. Seriously. Like this one will be LA Colors Profusion. <laughs> and next, um, that was a glitter from Profusion and Gold. Oh, this is Profusion, the exception of this one. And this is a Charcoal Pearl right there. That's Charcoal Pearl. And this is Space Pearl right here. And the last one is silver pearl and these three of course are next the last three these are all mixed as well yeah they used to be a dollar I told beauty supplies so I was checking out the mix and I was like uh-uh the wrong lipsticks and everything nothing's a dollar anymore <laughs> mix mm -mm -mm. um oh boy Yellow gold pearl. I'm sorry. You guys know I'm blind. That's yellow gold pearl. This one is sky pink pearl. Oh, that is gorgeous. I think I did a look at that one a few months back. Let me see. Hold on. There it goes right there. Sky pink pearl. Under that is purple pearl. Another beautiful one. And this green one is Lime Pearl. Lime. Gorgeous. And this is Pearl. Just plain Pearl. That's Pearl right there. And the bottom one, last but not least, is White Pearl. As you can see, I, I've used my pigments. I mean, I still have so much. Especially of the Profusion. Because, they, like I said, they were very generous. And, um... The containers and the LA colors I got into after the NYX. I got into Jordana, NYX, and yeah, those brands first. And last but not least is this stack right here. And yeah, these are Profusion. They started coming out with bolder colors. Now this is what the container used to look like. Um, I don't know if it still does. Don't quote me. I might be the same. I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But this is an um disco ball, and I have some in here because I use this for a contest look, and I won with the look I created. I applied this on my lids. Oh my goodness! I am so scared now. That is disco ball. If you can appreciate that, let me see. Hopefully, the camera's doing it justice. Anyways, it's gorgeous. Okay, this was a gift from the lovely Lisa Ann Beauty. And this is by a cosmetics company. It goes by the name of Starlux. 
never heard of them till Lisa. It looks like this. Yeah, it's a logo, star looks. On the bottom it says Wall Street, which is an area here in New York. It's beautiful. Okay, am I done with that? Oh no, I'm sorry. This is yellow gold pearl. And that's all I have left in there. I have some in one of the stacks. This is one that I have not yet even opened. And this is by Black Radiance. And this is in Sunset Sparkle. It's at the bottom there. It's beautiful. I know the label's not there, but um, it has the name here, and I'm going to have to save this. The number and the name Sunset Sparkle right there. I've not yet opened it. This one, I opened the label, the plastic, but I haven't gotten the opportunity to use it. And this is um, Plum Reflections, and I'm really excited to use this one. And it's Plum Reflections. And again, this is Black Radiance. You're going to see a lot of this mess going on. It's because, like I said, when we moved away, you're going to see a lot of on the sides and stuff. I had to tape my stuff up or because family was helping us move and you know how family can be. <laughs> oh, we're grateful though. This is another cosmetics brand from the beauty supply store and it was called Bon Bons. I need lip glosses and all kinds of stuff. Um, I don't remember, do these have names? No. 051, they go by numbers. Bon Bons. Sealed, gorgeous colors. I need, I need to step up my game. I really do. I mean, I was real good for using my pigments. It's brand new. This is another Bon Bon. Oh my goodness gracious! Yeah, um, loose pigments can be messy. Yeah, they can. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's beautiful though. See, I'm glad that happened. Make a beautiful highlight color too, or lid color, anything. Again, bonbons. Look at my hands. <laughs> Pretty sparkly hands. Yeah, these don't have sifters, and they're um, full to the brim. Zero four seven is this one. I'm sorry. Um, the white one. Nope, no number because I took the label off. Anyways. This is a lovely light gold color. This one's 044. It's a gorgeous baby blue. Oh my goodness, look at this. <laughs> look at the hands. <laughs> but um, they are beautiful. The colors are gorgeous. So you can see it put up at the bottom there. And these were two for a dollar. Got those four. But the beauty supply store was closing down, so. Okay, now I got three from Wet and Wild. This one's Orchid. And, oh, I'm sorry. Anyways, that's Orchid. Very beautiful. Updated packaging. And this one is white icing and this is more of a glitter type actually iridescent how beautiful that is you see you're gonna see that yeah it's all right and it is really beautiful white icing this one is white lotus this one's more of a pigment than um, white icing Okay, these are Full Fusion. It's an eyeshadow. And that pink is really pretty. And these came in, um, it was a little Full Fusion makeup kit a long time ago. 
I have to start using my pigments more. This is really special, and this is really messy right now. But, um, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Really so. Anyways, um, this is an eyeshadow that was made especially for me on my birthday a couple of years ago. And she named it, oh no, excuse me, this is a blush, I'm sorry. It's, she named it Sunkissed Rose. And she had um, some mica pigments and stuff, um, I think TKB Trading or Coastal Sense, I don't remember. But she made this blush for me. It is amazing, it's beautiful. I'm glad I started digging in here. And this is eyeshadow, Roses Night. She named this one Roses Night. And I T E. Look at that blue. It's more of a teal. It is gorgeous. This is from um, Sally's Beauty Supply Store. Pearly White. It's very iridescent. It's a very beautiful. Sally Beauty Supply Store. Very affordable. Hard Candy has sent me a package a few years ago. I forget what they sent me. It's <laughs> it's in my train case. Anyways, this was among the things they sent me. And this is a Hard Candy powder keg. And that is all pigment. And gunpowder. You know, it is gunpowder. And oh yeah. That it is. That's the applicator. I don't really, I don't want to take it out right now. Ooh. This stuff is really highly pigmented. Again, it's by Hard Candy. And they sent me a package. Once. This is a gift. It's by Beauty Rush. It's a teal loose shadow. An applicator. It's like that. It's beautiful. I should depart it. So, you know, because all this, you know, yeah, it's not working out, really. Oh, this is a L'Oreal loose shadow, but in here, it's, um, yeah, hard candy eyeshadow that broke, that I meant to, um, repress. Sorry about that. <laughs> This came in. I think it was um I don't remember. From the drugstore came in a little makeup kit. There's no name or number or nothing. You know sometimes these cheap little makeup kits have the most beautiful shimmers and loose powders and stuff. I think I'm gonna start doing a little series like at least once or twice a week, use pigment or two. I got these two orders that um or my daughter had done an order for me. Coastal Scents, this is that beautiful iridescent pink. And my husband also, and they sent me this glitter. Look how they've changed over the years. This is another order. Oh, this one has a name Mojito Mint. Take it out the bag. What am I doing? Really? <laughs> Who's gonna see that? That is mojito mint. Very cute. This is limited edition glitter powder. That's what it says there. Limited edition glitter powder. So, and it's beautiful. It's really beautiful. Oh, Venetian. That's the name of this one, Venetian. It's called Sense. Now, out. Oh, I did a tutorial look not too long ago using this one. And this is in Sweet. Just a baby pink, very beautiful baby pink. Sweet, there you go. 
I do use my pigments and minerals and these powders not as often as I should though. For the amount that I have, I should be using these more often. Okay, I have these. My daughter. I mean, this is a set. And, um, I didn't use these. I doubt it. Nope. See, this is, um, smoldering. Okay, no, little pack these three smoldering. Angelic. And this one is seductive. Now, if these two sound familiar, it's because I was sent a package by the amazing Lesbian Life 101. And she sent me these two smoldering and seductive again. The packaging is different, but I think that um, smoldering looks different. I've got to try it out. I've got to try them out, see if there's any differences. Because sometimes, you know, what appears the same, what appears to look the same, actually is not. So, okay. <laughs> I got this from my aunt years ago. It's a Powder Caress Powder Lights Chanel. And this is in Twilight. What it is is, um, what a little... That's just so uh brush off lose its form. But the color and this um loose powder is and can special it is absolutely gorgeous. Twilight. Okay, now we're gonna do Oh, let me show you this one. This came in a cheap makeup kit. I don't remember. In drugstore. Beautiful. I used this one time. My lids. Oh, okay. Let's move on to Jordana. Jordana has, has loose pigments. And this one is in brownie. That is brownie. Pink Rocker. Get back. Fell off. Pink Rocker. And that's Pink Rocker. And again, these are by Jordan. This one is Pink Quartz. Gold for Gold. My hands are full of shimmer. This one is, is this the label to it? Um, I'm gonna fall off sometimes. Nope. Anyways, it's a purple one. It's really beautiful. This one is going green. I got the plastic over the sifter. I haven't used this. Not yet. Intrepid. Oh no, this is not Jordana. This is a L'Oreal hip, and this is the only one I purchased from L'Oreal hip line. It's a. Uh, it's beautiful. It was the most unique pigment that um L'Oreal hip put out. Yeah, it's intrepid. L'Oreal hit. And that's why I purchased this. For its uniqueness. Oh, I had it with the Jordana ones and that wonder, yeah. Well, you can tell which ones are Jordana because they have the logo on the top. Anyways. <laughs> this is Bay Blue. And I was actually sent this one. A few years ago. A couple of years ago. Lovely Elizabeth, that was her name. Um, this is Black Tops. Hmm. 
Yes, it is. Bronze metal. I feel off now. I have to tape it. Bronze metal. This is my favorite one. And I, oh, I forgot the name of this and the label fell off. It's somewhere. You know, somewhere on there. But I think this is on. Oh, I forgot the name of it. I see he something Heather. Anyways. Um, in Massachusetts, my sister had gifted me this. It was two boxes. And it was by a cosmetics brand that does not exist anymore. And they were distributed by um, Barclays, though. Tropical and the other, I, I don't remember, and they're all mixed up now. So, anyways, they came in these little vials, and they were called Iodors, eye shimmers, Iodors. That's how they came in. I gotta be careful. Oh, saw that. Mm -hmm. Ask me where I depot. I just haven't had the opportunity, and these don't have any names or numbers, but anyways, that's that one, that's two separate little collections, there's another, I Adores, the Tropez, did I mention that, I'm sorry, um, the company name was, yeah, there it goes, Tropez, and they were manufactured by, as I said, uh, Mark Wins, like Wet and Wild, because that one, teal, but no guts, no glory, and there's that one, I love teal too, I love any, any shade of blue, I'm telling you, any and every, and the deepest, darkest navy, two teals, baby blues, powder blues, I, anything that has blue in it, I, I'm all in, and there goes that one, My hands got really, really dry with these, um, messing with these pigments and dried them out. Wait a second, I can wash my hands in a minute. And there's a charcoal one. That one. This one reminds me something of Intrepid. It does remind me of Intrepid. I'm going to go back into my pigments and the nose. There's a white one. too. They are so pretty. Yeah, pigments can be a little messy. The effects are so beautiful though. If you depot them, you know, I would go for the plastic containers that they sell in Michaels. I wanted to buy one so bad. And I went down to Michaels. They had um went out of business. I don't understand how. That place was always packed. Anyways. This is a very beautiful teal right there. Different tone. The other one was lighter. Let me have these. That's it for the Tropez. Okay. Phew. <laughs> You know what, guys? I give you a lot of props <laughs> for sticking around as long as you did for this crazy long video. Um, thank you so much for sticking by me. I do hope you'll enjoy it. These are my pigments, minerals, loose powders. Everything I own except for what's in the bottom of that green drawer, which is my nail art supplies. I have caviar beads. I have, you know, stuff for my nails. But I can use anything from any of these stacks or any one of these for nail polish, to make a nail polish. Anyway, that's going to be another video. I'm tired. I need water. Thank you all so very much for watching. God bless you all. Hope you enjoyed. And until the next time, 
May you all stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.